today uh, I'm going to um, show you uh, how to disassemble uh, uh, this very old rotor reel. Uh, this is a magnet cord PK6 and this is one with the, uh, only the transport and in a port portable case and you can see the case is just like that and uh, this is upper and you can open this open that and this side uh, you have the right here uh, you have the power switch and um, all the power cord is inside and this is open halfway you can see uh, it's right here all kinds of cord here and there is also have a power plug which is used to uh, uh, for uh, the connection uh, the power to uh, the preamp over there. So, uh, okay. And, uh, first, to have this open, let's uh, take out the the front. This is what looks inside, and uh, I'm gonna take this out from the cabinet. So, first, this is just some some uh, screws. Just lose uh, four some screws. And then we can pull this uh, handle, so like that. Just pull this out. There we go. That's what we have inside. And then, let's see. Okay. And the two power cord is uh, connected to uh, the uh, uh, connect to the power switch here and also connect it to that, uh, um, that outlet there so I'm gonna take that out and, uh, so first let me uh, I'm going to remove the power switch this it's, um, it's just a the power switch right here is just a knot. switch then I need to uh, remove the, the let me see yeah I need to remove that inside I think I still uh, I think I can uh, remove this and then it's probably easier to handle okay, just remove this uh, power plug here Use two screw. The power plug is uh, has to be pull out from this side. Let's see. Yep. Pull this out, and then uh, I see. Uh, see if I can. Uh, no. By the way, uh, I just realized. Uh, this is not the power output, this is actually the power input, so you should plug in the power cable uh, to this. And then the, that means the power is probably uh, from the preamp. But, uh, okay. right. So the power 
power cord is complete out. Then I need some plug list. Put this away. Get this out. Then, okay, this is out. It's is connected. This one I think. Yeah, this one is just a plug. So, cabinet completely uh, away from that so I can uh, put the cabinet away which we don't need anymore let's get the transport um, the first thing I'm gonna do is that I, I will uh, need to disconnect all these cables uh, but I don't want to uh, see yeah I think I do have to disconnect it otherwise uh, uh, yeah anyway I think I, I have I will label all of these wires and uh, before I do uh, more this cable uh, can just be unplugged yep. okay so that's how this uh, looks like. Is there any? Uh, let me say it was this way. Yep. And uh, yeah, you won't be able to uh, plug it reversely, so I don't have to label this cable. Let's label this. Let's call this one. One. One, it's called a seven. Okay. Alright. Alright. Then I can label each table. It's two lines of table here. Uh, okay. Okay, it's uh, like that. First wire. Let's do this. Okay. Call this number one. Then I call this upper one. U. Yeah. Then the next that's one lower. Next one, that's uh, let's call it one lower. Let's see, yeah, just do this. Okay, then I can remove that. So let's. Uh, Go back. Yep, I'm going to do this for each one of it, and I will also uh, take a picture so I don't uh, really. Let's take picture of this side. Take picture of this side. Okay, so uh, double protection. 
now I have all the wires take out and the labeled and uh, just also uh, just one thing interesting is that one of them pin in the cape uh, in the middle have two wires uh, together so then uh, next I think what we need to do is, is to uh, remove uh, some of the front component So uh, let's first remove that, just twist, take it out, it's a real ten turner, then uh, I think I can uh, remove all of this, mm. let's remove the pinch roller, it's just some screw, and, uh, so there's no washer, no washer, so let's put away Let's remove that and this is uh, the capstan is uh, kind of stick so I'm gonna apply heat later on and then I'm gonna I'm going to remove that so this does have a washer here. Take this out. Uh, we also have a washer there. So two washer and one roller. And then it's this. It's uh, same thing, I believe. Okay. Yep. So this is one washer here. Roller. Yes, uh, there is one washer here. So two washer, one roller. Let's put this away. Mm. Let's see if I can uh, remove this. Not. Uh, this maybe not. Then I think next I'm going to. Uh, I will need to remove the head. Let's see, the head is just a... Okay. The head is really just a fixed by those two screws, I believe. Let's see. Let me remove this head first. I think that's a uh, so one. Let's lose this. Okay, that is there a spring here? Just, just be careful. And, uh, this is just a plug. Just unplug it. Yeah, it's uh, just like that. The plug there is just uh, two wires on top. That's because this is a uh, uh, single. Now uh, this is a full track. So just remember this. Uh, it has this uh, two wires uh, on top when you put back. And uh, we have this, and we need to, uh, need to uh, unplug it again. Yeah. It's uh, right here. Okay. Right. right. So this, it does have two, uh, four wires to it, and just remember, uh, these two uh, the what I say. The brown wire is on top. And I think uh, we get this. That's uh, also the four track head. Uh, this one looks good, pretty good actually. 
we can uh, either remove that or we can remove that. I think I'm gonna remove this first. The noob. Let's see. To remove the noob, I have to. Uh, yeah, there are second screws here. So. Okay, let's put it like that. See, this one. Yes, yeah, that's correct. Let's remove the second screw. Okay. And it's out. Yep. Took this out and I checked there's no uh, second screw stuck inside, so it's simply just because it's uh, it's just uh, too long. The next part is uh, I'm gonna I have to uh, remove that and that's uh, this is completely stuck here, and I don't think it's uh, it can be easily removed like that. So, uh, what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna apply some heat. I'm going to apply some heat here. See if I can. Uh, after that, see if I can uh, remove that. Okay, <laughs> all right. <laughs> I took this out, this capstan out finally, which is good news. Then uh, we can remove uh, the rest of it. So this is how it's just a. Uh, it was just like that. Took this out. That's good. Next, uh, I'm going to remove uh, this motor, the supply side motor. To do that, uh, I have to remove this uh, first, this uh, uh, turntable first, and it's removed by loose uh, second screw right here. Yeah, that's right, it's right here. Mm -hmm. Let me see the size. Yeah. See, this is. Uh, that's a correct size. So just uh, get this. And then once that loose, uh, I think should be able to. I may have to take the screw, the second screw completely, and I think yeah, slide this off, and. Uh, that's how this uh, put on there. Then I can remove this model from it. It's just as a four screws here. It's uh, it's easy enough.
now the motor is out the two wires was connect there and uh, I took out earlier and then um, let's see we can remove this side this that's just a turntable and uh, it's again by lose this uh, second screw there Uh, hmm. It's not coming off. Then I, I think I also have to remove this. Uh, yep. I think I also have to remove this. I believe so, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's all good. So I have to remove that. I have to lose this. Lose it a little bit, I should be able to. Uh, yeah, just slide this off so this comes off like that. So now, uh, the next is that uh, you don't, you cannot really remove the whole uh, front uh, faceplate, uh, you do have to uh, remove um, this panel. And over there, that panel first uh, to gain access to the some of the screws here to remove this three screw here and uh, some screw here. Let's see. Uh, do you, let's do this first. These are the the screw and not here. A washer here. Do we have a washer here? Yes, we do have a washer. Okay, now let's see how I get rid of this. Uh, this part. Hmm. I also have, have to uh, remove this, otherwise, I cannot really slide this off. So that is. Uh, the three screws here. I also need to remove that. Okay, All right, it's out. Okay, so this is what we have right now. And then uh, I need to remove this. Uh, I think I can just mm. yeah. use that. Right. Huh, this one has washer so that's interesting that's this uh, okay I think I need to uh, remove the, the spring it's probably right yep this one okay let's remove the spring this part is loose Okay, so that connects to this. So that means uh, I also have to remove uh, remove this so that I can get that loose. Yeah, it's right here, so I can remove that. Then uh, 
this is actually uh, loose just like that so you can just uh, can just pull it off and uh, see that is uh, this is just loose yep slide this out I have to remove this uh, the micro switch here, which is screw and not okay. I think I can the first. I probably have to remove this from that. With we where there is a small screw here. So that's. Uh, which freeze this part oh there is also some washer there so let's pull this back so that I don't uh, so that we don't uh, forget okay all right so, uh, so now we have this removed freeze so that's uh, idler wire idler whale it's uh, hmm the rubber is not that bad. Then uh, we can uh, re remove this side. So there are uh, so many screen here. And then we can do the same thing for uh, this side. Mm, to lose that. Okay, let's see. First we have to... Uh, screw here then we have screw here 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 Let's see uh, uh we was... yeah i think it's just this that, that. okay let's first Let's see if we can uh, remove this part. Yep, it's, uh, it is loose and it's out. And we also have some. Oh, it connects to the. So this connects to the two connector here. But we also have uh, uh, have two wires. It's really uh, soldered to it. So what is that? Oh, okay. That's um, that's a bubble. Let's see if I can uh, remove the bubble here. Mm. Well, that is, we have two wires connects to uh, this, and uh, mm. let's see. Uh, that and uh, we just take this out so it's not so easy to get that holder out but I think at this stage I think I can uh, let's see It's also uh, maybe at this stage I can uh, remove the the front plate and doesn't get access to that. Let's see, that's this, this, this. So the front plate now uh, is a couple of the screws here, 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 here. 
let's see if I uh, remove this then see if I can uh, uh, get an access to that hmm. okay uh, all right it's just a loose and that the rest of it will be uh, inside so now I think I can uh, yeah I think I can just slide this off this, yeah that's that means I also have to remove uh, this ridge which is held by uh, that second screw So they said, take out, take out. Mm. Then let's see if I can. Yep, now I can remove that. Perfect. So I have that. I have that. This whole thing is off. There is a wire hook to that. Which, oh, okay. So this is a wire hook from here to that. So, which I will just put here and uh, get some tape so I know where it comes from. So, let's tape to that. Alright, so here we have the whole uh, uh, just for and such. Let's see. Uh, we have the flywheel. There we have a washer here. Mm. Okay, let's, uh, let's just tape this so that I don't lose the washer here. So let's put this away just uh, temporarily. That's along with uh, the power. Okay, there is uh, that's a spring. Which I know that is for uh, this. It's right here. So I'm gonna. Okay. I'm just gonna tape this so I don't lose that. Okay, alright. I think unless I, uh, unless I unsolder this, I'm not, I don't think I can remove this uh, holder from the whole thing. Let's just hold for it. Okay. Then let's see if I can remove this. So uh, when we put back, this should be easy. this uh, screw this and uh, should be able to yep yeah. and just simply unscrew this so next time we put back should be uh, it should be much easier it's just like that okay what do we have so this is for the pinch roller that's a pilot that's a recording light so this is uh, this is this must be play yeah this is a play uh, switch and this is a safety for play and um, it connects to uh, 
connects to uh, it's actually soldered directly to this where there is a capacitor there are some uh, sniper capacitor here this is for uh, two uh, two recording heads and that's uh, another capacitor not people with power that's a rectifier and this is a uh, main capacitor I believe that's uh, Okay, this main capacitor connects to the erase head, so that's that must be for that. All right, I think that's uh, that's this side. Let's get just another side. Oh, we have the flywheel comes off. Okay, the flywheel. It's just like this, and for mic cord, it's very special that. Uh, it has uh, this, see, like that, and here it has a ball here, which is loose and with oil, so I'm gonna uh, also tape that so I so that I don't lose a don't lose a steel ball here. Just like that. Yep. Alright. So this is off. The capacitor is off. So this also means if you want to replace this capacitor, this is how far you have to go. And then uh, we can also. Uh, So if you want to remove this, and uh, it's also uh, you have to do it from here, this side. And then you can remove the two thing, but it has to be from here. All right? This will get you uh, this off, and of course the two switch is easy. You just lose. Uh, the two knot here, which uh, I'm not gonna do it today. It's uh, it's pretty straightforward. So now for the if you want to remove the model, that's another thing uh, we're gonna check. The hard part is that uh, this this one, this is okay because I can access the uh, back end easily from here but uh, this is really under the model so uh, we'll see Alright, now I think the model, yeah, the model is off, just like that. This is for uh, for this uh, idler wire, wow, idler wheel, this one, I can do that, I think so, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's our model. So that's this idler wire, my wheel, and then uh, can remove that, remove that. Then this idler wheel is also uh, can be pulled off, just like that. Two screws, two screws, and um, yeah. Anyway, I think I I will just keep this. All right. So I think that's. Uh, yeah, I think that's how far I'm gonna go today. Okay, this is all we have today. We have the main model. 
and the capacitor and the switch and this is a model component which is the inside solenoids my idle wheel uh, my micro switch and then we have these two idle wheel, idle wheel here and this is uh, the side another idle wheel and this is a flywheel there is a switch and here we have all the screws and small component and then uh, here we have the supply or rewind model and then finally we have the front uh, front face plate over there okay so the next is that uh, we will try to put it back so the first thing I'm trying to do is to put the model back so let's insert this Is here okay? Let's do that. So let's first put the Alright, so uh, now the mortal is back. Then uh, let's put uh, let's put the two idler back. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Alright, and then uh, they want to put this back. Where I said this is a, it's not an easy part. Okay, Let's see if I can do this. Let's tighten that. See this. Yep, I can also tighten that, so I think that's still good. So it's uh, this idler ID2. Flip it. It's like uh, it should be like it should like this. See, this is how this uh, should be. This is right here, and this is uh, this is facing that. This is facing down. So if you can see. that see if I can uh, see what we have here 
So you think this may be a... Yep, yeah, I think I can remove that. That's interesting. Okay. Yep, yeah, I remove that. Then I can uh, insert this and then put the board to it. Let's put the flywheel back. And, uh, but don't forget uh, you have a washer this here. And you will also have a washer right here. Just like that. Let's see. Uh, and then uh, we can put this flywheel. Push this uh, that way, that way. I think I can uh, do it like this. Okay. Yep. And, uh, just gently pushing here. It's uh, just like that. When you pull this back, right? See the back? See, uh, um, where is that? See the hole here, right? So this is adjustable. That's because uh, the, the position of this uh, should also be adjusted to, um, to satisfy uh, this. So, uh, uh, it has to be uh, be careful that um, this has to be uh, remember this there's pin is here so it's that so you may have to uh, be careful that um, uh, the position of that the position of that is uh, uh, I mean so uh, you have to be careful the uh, position of this uh, is correct otherwise that uh, uh, you won't be able to, uh, uh, you won't be able to, uh, fit in, uh, uh, this part, this part to it. Uh, because, uh, this part is, uh, in the face, on the face plate, it's not so easy to get. So, uh, I use my screwdriver, uh, to put here and to measure the position. First, I'm gonna put this in the middle. Middle position, see if this works. Okay. Then uh, let's check. Okay, that's uh, how this should be. Let's see. Seems. Alright. So let's see if we turn it this way. Turn there. Turn it that way. There. So it's this has to go here. And, uh, this has to go here. Okay, that is tightened now. To put the face plate back, this is the hard part, as I said. The wire of this bubble is coming from, uh, coming through uh, this open here, and um, this, uh, those two is from this open. And uh, I think this is how we do it. So uh, remember this spring that is ho that hooks to this uh, the pin roller arm. I believe so, right? Yep. So it's, uh, it's right here. Yeah, it's down there. This spring hooked to uh, the small hook here for the pin roller arm. And this has to be hooked before we uh, put them back. Then uh, we will try to slide this off, and uh, these two. Don't forget these two. And um, so there are two holes there, so one for each. And uh, this spring, don't lose it. So 
that's what I'm seeing now. It's, uh, it's quite not so easy. We, of course, we also need to insert the capstan uh, from the hose here. Let's just have to. The capstan hose is in the here. It's here, so uh, it's, I don't think I can show you right now, but uh, you will get the idea if you are trying to uh, put back yourself. So we have to make sure everything sort of in uh, some place. Capstan uh, first. Insert the capstan. Oh, capstan is in. Then we insert this into one of the hole here. Okay. That just have to okay. One is in. Let's get another one. Put it kind of right. So, yeah, another one I can probably. Uh, Insert later, I guess. Or not. Okay, it's just, uh, it's just patience, patience. Okay, it's here. Hmm. Push this in. Then, uh, push that in. Okay, yep, we have to push this. Alright, so I have both um, inserted and there was a capstan inserted. Okay, down there. Don't have anything uh, stuck, All right? Down there. Okay, it's good. This capstan is like that. Oh, this one's loose again. But, uh, I think I have uh, yeah. temporarily. I think I have everything holding just like this. So essentially, uh, I uh, hooked a spring for the pinch roller arm of this. Insert the capstan through this hole, and then uh, this and that. It has to be uh, it has to be uh, inserted back here uh, this and that so that's all you have to do just be careful and then the, see these two bubble the wire for the bubble is coming from uh, uh, this small open here um, as for this, that will go through there later on. Next, I'm going to uh, put all the screws back. Should not be. Let's get this first. Yep. That screw is okay. This one, Let's see, hmm. yeah, it's also not so easy. So, I'm gonna 
Put the screw first. Okay. The reason I'm doing this because I'm gonna flip this over for the screws. Okay. Just flip it over. That's easier. Let's get the uh, second. All right, so I get uh, all three there, and let's flip this again, then tighten it, put it this way, okay, then uh, I can tighten all of this. Uh, Okay, alright, I think we've done this side, we're gonna flip over to another side. Just a little bit careful. Let's, uh, let's flip here. This one's very... This, this way. The next part, I think I'm gonna do is to put this back. So that means to insert this to here. Just remember uh, for uh, for this deck, right? The the one with two wire, so that's a erase head. The one with four wires, so that's a, a play head. And if you are very lucky to have the one with two. Uh, with two channel, then uh, you may need to uh, um, label it before I take take it out. But right now I can just pull this back, and I think this is uh, much easier now. So this side. This one. Okay. There's that one. Okay, that's good. Then now I think I can uh, just get this. Let me make sure I can still get the head. So that's the raised head, two wires. That's good. And here is. Head. So that's good. Share this. And the thing uh, we do uh, this. That's the hard part. Hmm. Okay. I will first connect this. Uh, connect this to that, I think. Yep. That has to be. I think this is done. Like that. And this is. Okay. So this is like that. I think. I think this is. Okay. I think this is uh, like this. Yep. So let's remove that. That. Okay. And, uh, this needs to be insert here. Okay. All right. And uh, this is also to adjust the position so that. This can push that, that button, but uh, I'm not. Now 
not trying to use this anytime soon, so I just put I just put this uh, as in a position. And uh, if you are you in the you want to use this, you have to make sure when this goes in, you need to push that. Okay, all right. So that's this, and uh, this has to be there. This spring, which is most nearest, must go to uh, this one, this hole here, and uh, there are two springs here, upper. Uh, so it's right here, so that's upper. It goes to the, the, the upper hole here, but then uh, inside, most inside, there are two uh, springs there that goes to here. So, um, we can do that later on. But first, is that uh, we have to put this back. And, uh, that is also the challenging part. Let's see. Let's put it this way. Because that is right here. Right? So that's, uh, that's what we need to have here. So I need to put this back. Need to insert this a little bit. Then uh, here, right? Then the washer, then the nut. To this temporarily. Then I need to insert that uh, small uh, piece to it. Circuit. So I can show you what I have here. It is at that. See that? It's at the square and the knot. It's that has to be inside. Uh, insert there, and then tighten. Now let's uh, that insert it. See, it's come out. And, uh, let me put this like that. Let's try to uh, turn the. Not tighten it. Hopefully. Yeah. Okay. At least uh, I can temporarily tighten it. It's just like this. Yep, that's how it's doing. So, okay, that's good. Then we can uh, put the screw of all of this in place. Yeah, I think I also have to uh, get the spring. Uh, I have to touch the spring first. Uh, the rest one. Let's see. I have to touch this first, otherwise I won't be able to later on. It's, uh... Okay, it's, uh... let me put this first. So this, the nearest one, that is that attached to this hole. Yep. Get this in. Yep. Oh, I missed one. Crap. 
Alright, it's here, here. It's right here, the two spring. Use my this two. Did I get a, get a one? Crap. I think I can I just hook one at a time. Just hook one here. Yeah, it's much easier. Then I hook another one. Uh, this is one that uh, inside. Almost uh, inside. So, the second one uh, that's uh, it will hook right here. Alright. Then, uh, so that's uh, we have the nearest one goes here, most inside goes here, and then here, upper. It goes to uh, goes to there. That's what we're gonna do. Okay. So this has to be go here. So, all right. So that's good. It's all hooked up. Mm. Then we can pull this back. Finally. To do it sideways. <clears throat> okay, let's put it sideways. Alright. Okay, so now I think it's all easier, easy part. Very nice. Then, uh, get all of this. Now I'm going to put uh, the rest back. First, I think I'm gonna put, the, put back the four for the capstan. So this skill ball uh, this just drop it uh, in here and uh, get the second screw So let's make sure the capstan move freely. Uh, seems fine. Let's see. I uh, think it's okay. Let's put this first. Let me put this one. Uh, this is a uh, Fast, um, fast forward. Yeah, that sounds that looks like it. Seems fine. So I just get this. Oh. When you put this back, you should also be careful. See there? See that open? And that open uh, position of that open uh, needs to be very careful and adjusted so that um, uh, when you press, uh, when you press, when you turn in this, it will uh, correctly uh, push that micro switch. 
so just let you know if you happen to once you put in if you uh, it's not turning the micro switch correctly so that's what you have to adjust uh. that so we should be able to just tighten it's turn yep I can hear it so that's good so now we need to pull this back but uh, remember right now without this right now this is in the playback position and also that means that uh, this I mean, the pinch roller is in playback position, so um, that means this has to adjust it, and uh, we have to lose this a little bit, and the playback position is this, so this switch it on, that's the playback position, then we can uh, Let's tighten it so that's a playback position yep and if we do it like that that's stop see this move to there and this that's uh, rewind still like that see so now uh, it's good okay we are in the now we adjust that into the stop position. Look at this. This is in the middle of this hole, so that means it it is in the correctly uh, in the stop position. So that's what we're gonna do. We can now we can uh, put the loop just uh, back this and uh, this move to tighten that all right let's see if we push this play back go back stop rewind stop play back so that's how you do this So I think we uh, complete this part, this part, next is that I'm gonna put this back, that is this, so, so next I'm gonna put this this back. It's right here. This is for the um, uh, take up. Okay, let's put here. I think it's um, all right. I think I have to do it this way. Okay. I think this. Okay, all right. So uh, here, that's what we have here. See, that's what we have here. We just put back, and then um, it says uh, that's a supply. We remember we take this like that. We insert this. We insert this like that, and we insert this. Okay, yeah. Okay, 
Yep. To do it like that. Right? So, like this. Like that. That's good. So, first, that's a setting screw right here. Tighten this. Another second screw, remember? Oh, yeah. It's... Okay, we have another second screw right there. This is not tight enough, I guess. And then we do another second screw right here. Okay, yep, yep, it's tight. Right. So we do a uh, fast forward. It should, uh, yeah, in this software will catch that. That's good. No, yes, that's okay. So we finish this part. Then we can uh, move to put this back. There is a mortal here. Okay. I'm gonna put the rewind mortal back. Hmm. It has this for a second screw, I was wondering. Maybe I also should do it for that. But, uh, let's do it this way. Okay. Alright. Okay, let's put this. And uh, let's see. I think it's like this. Yep. good then we put this uh, turntable back it should be like this that is a second screw has to be uh, has to be uh, lying up to that flat space Good. Oh, this has to has to be a little bit. Okay. Let's do this a little bit. And okay. It's tightened. Yep. It's tightened. So good. Let's do the head first. I'm not. I'm not going to uh, do the asthmas like that. I just put back. Tell you. So the head. Remember these two are uh, like the brown color. So that's top. So that that means it's this this way. We have the two screws. Okay, the one without uh, the spring is to the right. Okay, it's getting the one with the spring. That's the left. So. Then uh, this. Okay, 
that's a erase hit. And two uh, wire is on the top. So we plug in. Okay, alright, it's two heads. Let's put the cap stem back. Uh, the larger hole is inside, smaller hole is outside. And then we have this uh, screw. Let me see, maybe it's another one. It's a longer screw, I think. Yeah, so longer screw is for that. Then the shorter screw is for the uh, pinch roller. It's good. We have this roller. So remember there are two washer. One washer inside. Then the roller. The washer. It's not so easy, so I'm gonna put it like this. That's easier to do. I think that's good now. Alright, then we do this one. It's the same thing. It's uh, first one washer inside. Then get this. Then cut that. Okay. It's all good, so uh, this has been put back. Finally, this push twist locked. That's a real locker. Push, uh, push down, twist lock. Alright, so we finally get the main transport, everything uh, put back. Oh, no, sorry, not uh, one. That's me correctly. Then it's all of this. Now I have all the wires connected. Now 
Now, uh, this time it's truly that everything has been put back. Okay, first we plug this uh, connection cable. It is only one, uh, one direction, so we just have to try see which one, which direction works. Okay, set. Then that's up. This is a power. Um, let's see. Do switch. Let's see. slide this in temporarily so that I can connect the power cable okay. let's move this this way okay. now I'm going to uh, put this uh, this back to here and I need to uh, uh, make uh, get this wire through this hole first. First, the power wire. Let's uh, do this like that. Then uh, it connects to this. Put this back and there's a uh, two screws. Like that all right, so this has been put back. Next is this power switch, which is right here. Okay, it's right here. I just have to. Insert it. Okay, here we go. So, Alright. Alright, come out and use this to hold it. like this all right okay so you can put that back and this here let's make sure no wire uh, tumbling around seems okay let's put it back into the cabinet into it okay it's Everything's good. So, uh, then it 
just need to uh, put all the sump screw. Now I can move this back right like this. Alright. So I can just put in uh, all the sump screw back. Okay. That's everything. The cover. Close. Everything has been put back. So that's all of it. Thank you for uh, watching.